Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we are here to look through my new YouTube diary and if you've been with me for a while and you think oh I've seen this before. That's because I have gone back to it. Now, for 2018, I got a large A4 planner. Now, I love this planner so much, but I felt I was neglecting her, so I have to get her back out. So, if you don't already know, this is my A5 Filofax in the shade Duck Egg Blue. It is one of the originals. It says it in the buckle. It was like one of the new originals, if that makes sense. <laughs> they kind of like revamped it and brought it out. So, this is what the inside looks like. Ah! I love it, okay, so, uh, my, sorry, I'm zoomed in a little bit too much. There we go, perfect. So here I have my Ted Baker pen. It doesn't really match the theme, but I have my Ted Baker pen. So I have brought the same diary, basically this, but in the A5, and I transfer it into here. So this is all the spare paper that came with it, because I just have some lined paper so I could write a load of notes. This is too much, and this, is the front cover so all i've done i have got my dividers and i have cut it out and i have stuck it all together and i've added the tabs so the tabs are a little bit soft because obviously there was nothing joining them but anyway and then on the back i have added this beautiful pink sheet so i've done some wash tape around the edges and i've just laminated it and that is my January divider. And this was what I was getting at when I said I wanted to make dividers with it. And I love it. So this is my January. No one else knows what they're doing either. I think that is beautiful. I love quotes. I love quotes. I absolutely love them. Okay, so on the first page, I have my YouTube background, basically, for the year. So on the 1st of January, I always put how many subscribers, how many views, and what my total earnings were. And that always goes on here. I've got it in the other book as well. I won't show you guys that when it's filled in. But I like to see it so that I can see how many I get from this year to last year and then obviously i'll do it from this year to next year just so i know it's in paper and if it's in paper and i've physically written it down then i know it and i that's what i like so this in fact let me get you a different page a page that's got nothing on to start off with so this is how i set my diary up so each page has an all you need is love a love heart and some little stamps things like that just to get rid of the page. these are what i do not film on so obviously it goes monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday and then i've got a note section i also have some, some tick lists at the bottom i clean about every year i wish i could change the color of that but it's okay i can live with it so every day i stick a sticky note that i film and i can write down what film i want to do, do there and then i can always swap it if i get a better idea and oh maybe that'll be better on a sunday so i can swap it around not that i really care what goes up because i'm not like that i don't have like rubbish videos on a tuesday I just try and yeah but if something comes up like something comes through the post i'm dying to get it out there and up to you guys i could swap it around so this is where my planning comes in so this runs from the end of the year so for an instance we have my last day of my advent calendar we have obviously sorry the christmas eve's advent calendar the last day and then under here i've got a merry christmas video because i always do you guys a merry christmas video and i haven't got anything else planned but if we start to go through we have a december's favorites and an empties regrets and reviews i always plan an empties regrets and reviews and a favorites in every month now so we get to february february divide is the same look january favorites that is pretty much oh what i watched in 2018 regrets and reviews these are just little videos that i have already planned in then we get to march so this is quite an old diary this is one of my personal diaries but i love the quote so i've kept it so we've done that for march because obviously it was blue and i tried to match the colors up which sounds dead strange i know um i don't think the pink really went but the pink does go so it's okay so this one I went with blue, so I put it in March. This could be the best day of my life. And I went with this grey colour, but it can look a bit green, but it is definitely grey. So obviously this month I also have some empty regrets and reviews. I think I also have a birthday, what I got for my birthday video plan, April. And then we have May. So I've gone with purple for May, because then I've had one of each colour done. So this one says, be yourself, because an original is worth more than a copy. And then I've had the grey on the back of that one as well. I'm going to try and keep the grey to most of them, apart from pink. And they are all the dividers that I've done. So I've got three so far. And I love them so much and it makes me so excited. I am going to try. Oh, hello. And see if I can cut this out and if it fits in here if it, on one of my dividers. If it does not fit, for an instance, there, if it looks too silly because I've cut too much, because obviously that's supposed to be the C. If I've cut too much out and it doesn't fit, then I will just order this again in an A5 version and use that because I have issues with diaries. But yeah, I just thought I'd take you through a quick look through of my planner, so I've got some Tinkerbell washi tape. And this is basically all it is. 
And then we get to December and we have advent calendars, plan galore. And these extra stickers are for films, obviously on the normal day. And that is how I do it. I've been doing, oh, and some Christmassy washi tape. I've been doing it like this for a while now. And this is the, uh, this is what's stuck. I tried loads of different ways and every year I kind of tweak it. But this is what I'll go back to. And I've also got one spare sticky note just in case I need it for anything, just on my diary. But yeah, this is the method I find that I love. It's easy. I can swap things around. If I get a video and I go, oh no, 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 no. I've got to put this in because it was out this month. I can just swap a sticker around and it's great. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video of how I have planned my 2019 YouTube diary. I hope you like it. I love it by the way. I absolutely love it. I'm so happy I got her back out. I yeah I think because now I can order my 2020 diary and then put the January at the back and I can actually start putting January into it because I like to have a 12 month roll in diary I do with my personal diary so yay I know I'm crazy I'm crazy okay so I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching this video if you did like this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up click here if you'd like to subscribe click here if you'd like to check out one of my latest videos and click over here if you'd like to see a video that YouTube has selected for you I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching this video take care I'll see you in a few days with another one and bye bye